Greetings and welcome to the Chinese American World War II Veterans Congressional Gold Medal Project Ceremony. Today, we're honored and pleased and very happy to have two living veterans here with us this morning. And it's an honor for us to present the Congressional Gold Medal to these two gentlemen. My name is Ed Gore, National Director of the Chinese American World War II Veterans Congressional Gold Medal Project as part of Chinese American Citizens Alliance, CACA, based in San Francisco. Well, as I said today, it's an honor for us to have two veterans here who served their country with pride, with honor, and of course, in, in a way that dignifies all of us today. I want to tell you a little bit about our project here, since I've got a few moments to explain how this project got started, where we are with it today, and the challenge that was presented to us when we, Chinese American Citizens Alliance, began this back in 2017. Through the two acts of Congress, or two uh, bills that we presented in Congress, H.R. 2358 in the House and S-1050 bills in the Senate, we were able to introduce these two bills. And of course, it requires two thirds of Congress to pass these bills. So with that challenge, it requires a tremendous amount of advocacy work, all the grassroots efforts of letter writing, campaigning, uh, in terms of, of contacting the Congress persons. And I wanna say the first uh, year that we had, we were, we were close to halfway through uh, gaining the two thirds. So in the House, of course, it was 290 out of 435. In the Senate, it was 67 out of the 100 we needed. So the challenge for us was not so much in the Senate, it was fairly, fairly quick to, ma to mass the 69 that we ended up with, but the House is where the challenge becomes. As you know, in, 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 as far as Chinese American populations in many states across the country, can you imagine how many Chinese are living in Idaho or North Dakota or South Dakota, or sometimes in the Midwest? Very, very few. So, so it's almost literally impossible to have that happen, uh, that in one session of Congress, we pass this bill. And I want to acknowledge actually all of our retired military, people such as General William Chen, people such as Robert, General Robert G.F. Lee in Hawaii, as well as a whole cadre of retired admirals and generals who helped advocate on the Hill with us. They did as much of the walking and the talking as, as uh, some of our other members at CACA. So I wanna congratulate and thank them because I would say without question, without their help, without their insistence and holding us accountable as civilians to walk the hill, to contact congresspersons to pass this bill, we as Chinese American veterans, as well as the community would not have this congressional gold medal to be proud of. So hats off to you, General Chen, you're here with me today to present this. So I thank you for, for being part of this. Let me now introduce uh, someone that those of you in California know fairly well, Speaker of the House, Nancy Pelosi. She'll be on a video with us and some of you have seen this video before. I thought it'd be appropriate for Speaker Pelosi to make comments as well. I think it's important for her to say these things because it represents what Congress